Here we go. Hey everyone, it's me Amber. Sorry about the background. It might be a little bit messy, but whatever. Um, and today I'm going to be doing a Primark haul and I'm really excited to be doing this video. So I guess I'm just going to get straight into this. So the first thing that I have is this. Like this is um, a, ma uh, a makeup bag. Um, and I just thought that this was absolutely beautiful. And I just, like, it's hollow. It's like... The actual colour of it is like a rainbow kind, um, the actual colour is pink, but when you hold it to the light you kind of see rainbows reflecting, so I just thought this was absolutely beautiful, um, and yeah, I got this in Primark for uh, £5, and this is by PS, so yeah, really happy with this. Uh, the next thing that I have is this, now this is Mermaid Mocktail. Uh, and this is like a really cool cup and it's got a little stopper on the bottom um, so the straw doesn't come out and it's like a little jar uh, that you put like your drink in um, and I've heard you can make like um, what they call, do you know those cakes in a jar? I've heard that you can make uh, things like that with these so yeah that would be cool if I could attempt doing that um, and I have actually just been using this because I've just had my dinner um, I used this and I actually had, I was a little bit naughty and it actually had some coke in it. Um, but yeah, I absolutely, this just caught my eye and I just absolutely fell in love with it. So, shut up car horn, I'm trying to make a video. So, the next thing I have is in my big Primark bag. Um, and this is one of the miniature ones. I've got a huge one here. We've got like four of these. And then two of these little ones. We've honestly bought so much. Um, but everything in that big bag isn't for me, it's for my dad. So, uh, I'm going to do this in categories. So my first category is going to be nails. So I'm going to take out these two. Which I got, which I just thought were amazing. And hold on, let me take the bag out. goodness the mess that mess Ugh. whoopsies I ripped the bag oh I'm just making a mess here okay there we go um so the stuff I got is all here so the first I'll push this over a bit. The first category that I have is nails. So I got these French tip um, nails, as you can see, and I just fell in love with these. I thought they were really cute, um, and I'm actually going to be putting these on tonight because my polish at the moment is like wearing off, um, and I picked it off on this hand because, like, once I get polish on, I have to pick it off. It's like really hard not to. Um, but I got these French tip nails um, and these um, come 36 nails um, with adhesive so yeah um, second going along with the subject of nails is these uh, false nails these come these are the design nails these come with 24 nails and adhesive again uh, and I just thought these had like a really pretty um, how do I say like tie dye kind of effect and they're like all my favourite colours as well. But there's no blues in here, but there is greens, so and purples, so that's good. Um but I don't really think that I'm that girly, I'm just kind of obsessed with makeup a bit. Um uh, the next thing I have are these manicure sticks. I think the I'm pretty sure that these are cuticle brushes. Um and I got these for one pound, and all of these were one pound, so that's three pounds. Um the next things Actually, I've got an idea. Okay, so I'm going to kind of pick them up, show them, put them in. So, still, again, going along the subject with nails, um, I have 
these two polishes one of them is my mum's so this one is mine so I got like a white creamy polish this is by PS and I really just like this colour it's kind of just a plain white but it is pretty nice and I, I, I will do a swatch on my nail for you see how pigmented this is I have a feeling it won't be that pigmented but because a lot of the whites that I have they're all opaque I haven't really got a stiff white like this so put that here so you can see it with the side and then here's my nail still got a bit of polish on okay that's pretty pigmented like I wiped the brush dry so that's pretty pigmented okay so that's good I like pigmented polishes and this is actually a pull off lid cap so you, the, uh, the aim of the game aim of the game <laughs> is to kind of pull it off and then clip it back on again and it's just in this really cute packaging and I just kind of fell in love again um, and here is the polish that my mum got she got like a deep burgundy kind of colour and I just thought hers was pretty nice as well but I'm not I like dark lipstick colours and dark eyeshadows but I'm not so keen on dark nails although I do have a dark colour on now um, and on my toenails but my toenails are ugly so I don't want you to see them um, oh it dries very fast okay cool <laughs> uh, so the next thing is let me see here plastic all over the bed um, I've got the 25 nail polish remover pads and these are acetone free so they won't dry your nails out um, and this is one pound and I'm actually going to undo the plastic on this and see if I can kind of give you guys a little demo on how they work that's why I swatched this on my finger so I don't, I've never had these before so sorry if like I don't really know what to do with them because it is true I do not know what to do um, but I'm pretty sure that you just wipe them on your nails or something, I don't know. Um, I'll figure it out. So, as soon as I find a way to open these, I'll figure them out. Ah, here we go. Oh, okay, so it's a twin pack, it's a double. It does actually say twin pack on them. I guess I'm just such an idiot. Okay, so there's two tubs oh wow um okay oh they smell nice mm. i wish like a camera could pick up scents because this smells really good um and this is by ps of course i'm kind of obsessed um 25 nail polish remover pads so it's supposed to be 25 so then I'll have 24. Oh, okay, so they're like, they're a weird... Just check I'm not using two. They're like a weird feeling to them. I am using two. <laughs> okay, so they're, they're, they're very, very small. I'm using three. Wow, I was using four. Okay, so these are very small. But I guess let's just test them. Wow. That was amazing! Like, one swipe and it came off. Okay, that is cool. I'm going to be a little bit gross and I'm actually going to save that. <laughs> and now my fingers are all greasy. But yeah, I got two of these because it came in a twin pack. And they were both a pound. So, yeah. Da -da -da. Ah. Do you know what? I'll deal with that later can't bother with dealing with that now next I have wait no I have yes I have got one more nail thing two more nail things um and this which is what I'm excited about is like they're like do you know how women would use say and I guess some men would do it as well um they'd use like clean up brushes like kind of soaked in acetone or a nail polish remover um, to remove like any fallout or yeah um, this is actually like to, to save 
having to having to like spend ages soaking in so soaking your nail brushes and acetone remover and things like that. Um, and these are if I can unpackage it. Da -da 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 -da. These were one pound, um, and this is like a little pen thing. Oh my gosh, this is cool. Did it just come out? Or do I have to pull it? What happens? <gasps> Whoa! Sick! Okay, so you use it to remove, like, the extra bits on your nail that you just can't get rid of. That's amazing, that. Okay, yeah, that is pretty cool. So, and then you've got little extra of these tip things in there. Which kind of goes on the end. And it's kind of like a marker for your nails. It's a marker! Okay, I'm really excited for this. I don't know why I'm getting so excited. I feel like a tiny baby. Um, even though I'm nearly 11. Huh? Um, but... <laughs> So I've just used it so it's kind of blue now, but it's like a little marker for your nails and you hold it upside down, shake it, and then you put it on your nails and it removes nail polish on your nails and around your skin. Okay, I'm not going to lie, that is really cool. So I got two of those because my mum said that they wouldn't be enough. Uh, next, I have, also I got this outfit as well. Ta-da! Um, next, I'm going to go for the body, because that's all I have for nails. So body, which is like everywhere kind of, um, I got the, this is £1.50, and I got the Get Fruity Body Spray, and this is the emoji one, and this smells so good, like, it smells really nice. I just absolutely love the smell. Um, so yeah, and this is get fruity as I said. Uh, it does smell pretty fruity actually, and I really love the design of the bottle because it's got like emojis on it. So yeah, that's cool. Next I have, which I'm going to share with my mum because my mum uses them. Um, these by are by PS. Uh, these these are one pound, and these are face treats. One step cleansing nose pore strips uh, and they're aloe vera so that is good and then you get four so I'll be having two my mum will be having two uh, so these are just nose strips um, so yeah nothing special really uh, now I'm gonna go yep body again I got these super cool glasses and I'm gonna show you what happens right so this is what they look like and they, they come with a case and all together these were £2.50 um, and yeah so watch this okay so I have a little switch here isn't that cool like these would be great just for filming because they give me really good light but isn't that really cool they're amazing and I love them so much and you've got like little switches on the bottom, so you just... <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> so you just kind of switch them on. Um, and then they come with the cute case, as I've already said. Um, which was like 50 pence. The actual glasses themselves are about a pound. Um, well, whatever. Um, so I got those, and I also got a brush. Just kind of staying with the body. This is um, egg sponge, okay, egg sponge with foundation brush. So this is a double, as you can see, and this is by PS. This is, this was £2 by PS. Uh, and I just kind of love the, it's like a rose gold kind, um, and I love rose gold. So, yeah, my cornet, no, not my cornet, my cornet isn't rose gold. My borrowed trumpet at school is rose gold. Because I play trumpet and cornet or whatever you want to say. So, 
sorry, I'm just obsessed with that. Okay, um, now I'm going to show your hair things. Ugh, way too old to be doing that. And I've actually lost my other hair things. Where on earth have they gone? Oh well, shame on me. I lost them. Had a tiny bit left. <laughs> I got these hair clips. Uh, these were two one fifty, um, and I just love these because they're like little rose and they're rose gold again. Like a boss, come on, you know it's true. <laughs> so, yeah, got them. And I kind of fell in love with these again. Um, but I saw them and my mum pointed them out and I was like, oh, I don't like those. And then she pointed out a few other things. And I was like, well, they're kind of the best of the bad bunch, so I might as well get them. And I do actually think they kind of suit my skin tone because I like to think I'm pretty pale. Well, I don't like to think I'm pale because that means I'm going to get like foundation and concealer. I have to get them super light and it's really difficult to find a foundation in my skin tone, but whatever. But I did find one. But, um, yeah, these are really nice and I absolutely love these. Uh, now I'm going to go on to, uh, like, face products. So, first of all, I have this liquid foundation, oil-free oil formula. Um, enriched with vitamin E uh, and this is semi matte medium coverage foundation suitable for all skin types so that should be good because I have pretty sensitive sensitive skin uh, so yeah so yeah uh, I'm gonna find a way to undo this Ugh. haze in my teeth Okay, I cannot open this. Maybe if I twist it. Or maybe that'll just ruin the bottle. Oh well. Um, I don't know if you just heard me, but I said um, maybe that'll just ruin the bottle if I twist it. Um, so, I'm also trying to be really loud in my videos, but I keep forgetting. So I'm going to have to like, sorry if I'm like whispering and then I'm kind of going higher. <laughs> But that's just how it works. And this is in the shade Ivory. And this was £2.50. As y'all can see. And yeah. So I just really love this. Because I saw like the colour. And I was like they finally finally got. I couldn't find a concealer. Which is actually surprising. Because they normally have more concealers than foundations. Um, uh, when we go to the PS section in the in the Primark but today they had like a lot of concealers but they were all in the shade dark and I just thought that's too light for, that's too dark for me um, I need like a lighter one otherwise I just look a bit weird I was considering kind of getting a darker concealer and using it as a contour but I've already got like loads of cream contours so I don't really need that um, I'm just saving money here okay like, I could get it if I wanted to, but I didn't because I'm good. Uh, Finally got it open, but it uh, doesn't taste nice. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Okay, so it's in a pretty small bottle. Mm. It smells like sun cream. Which I guess is a good sign. Uh... So I'm going to do a little swatch of this. Swatch this, swatch that, swatch everything. Swatch my life. Um, okay, so. Actually, maybe I shouldn't because I have had fake tan on my hands. Because I'm always going on about how pale I am. Okay. Uh, I'm going to get a mirror. And I'm going to swatch it on my chin no my yeah my chin I think we might have been safe yeah we're safe okay it's that it's still pretty dark as you can see but I guess it'll do so yeah next 
along the lines of face. <gasps> it's broken. Oh well. Next, I have this, oh my gosh, mineral based powder. This is by PS. This is loose face powder, so I need to be super careful. Oh no, it's all over fluid. <gasps> I can't believe I'm about to do this, but... <coughs> Powder fumes going everywhere. Oh. Okay. <coughs> so we've got that. So yeah. I'm never opening that again unless I do my makeup. Okay, so this is the loose face powder. It's mineral based. Mineral powder. Now, I'm going to go, oh no, I've got another hair clip. I forgot to show you guys. Oh, I've got this one as well. Now this is a bobble and a hair clip. So you can use both at the same time or just one of the two. Um, just dump all the rubbish on the bed. So you've got her. So this is what it looks like. I guess it would be for like a wedding or something, or just like if you've got like a really pale outfit on. How do I actually look? Jeez. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. But so sit. So that's what it looks like. It's got like fluffy feathers at the side. Um, and it's got pearls in the middle and then on the back you've got the little clip but then you've also got this hair tie so you can use it as like a hair tie and a clip or just a clip or just a hair tie or whatever so yeah I thought this was a really pretty but I don't think my mum likes it but I don't really care to be honest because it's my hair not hers sorry mum if you're watching because you will be because you watch my videos it's kind of awkward but um I'm giving my mum a shout out. Hi mum. Okay, so now I'm going to, yeah okay she'll run out. Okay, so now I'm going on to uh, eyes. So I got this which is actually my mum's. This is the Volumising Mascara. This is one pound and this is in the shade brown. Pretty plain and bland, it's just brown. And I'm not going to open this because I have a feeling my mum won't want me to. So yeah. That's the shade my mum got. And she also got another one because she's always moaning about how stubborn and like down and short her eyelashes are. So she got a lash defying mascara and I think this is supposed to lengthen your eyelashes. And yeah find volumizing length lengthened lashes uh, so it says on the back a unique flexible brush perfectly coats the se and separates lashes and creates defined volumized lengthened lashes so there isn't really much to open here so I'm just going to show you guys and this is like in a really pretty kind of container it's like a lilac purple and this is by PS like everything I think pretty sure everything we've got is PS yeah I'm pretty sure no wait yeah so she's got this. Oh wow, that's pretty. That looks cute. Okay. So that is the applicator. Is that what you call it? Probably. I don't know. But yeah, I'm going to put this back in the box and pretend none of that ever happened. And now I have... Now I bought this one. Well, mummy did, but I got it from... She got it from me. She got it from me. Twist. It. Okay, yeah, I think I just broke it. It wouldn't be a surprise to me, to be honest. I break everything. Us two, look at what we see. You, me, you. Da, 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 da. Sorry. Um. So. I 
Do you know what? I am just sick of opening things. Just for the sake of a video. It's really, really annoying. But, oh well. Uh, this is in the shade. Charcoal. This is a black eyeliner. This comes with a pencil sharpener. This was one pound. Yes. Whoops. Well, there's your eyeliner. Together, together. Okay. Static reactions. This video is science. Comment in section. Comment in the comment section below. Hashtag this video is science. If anybody actually does watch my videos, then I will know. Mum, challenge. So yeah, this is the smudgered, smudgered, smudger eyelash. I. Why can't I speak today? Okay, this is by P.S. This is the smudger eyeliner. Boom, got it. Uh, this is in the shade Charcoal and it's basically just black, nothing that special about it and it comes with a pencil sharpener and a smudger. I love like smudging the, the bottom lashes and things, it's just fun! Okay, so yeah and this was a pound, so pretty cheap for an eyeliner to be honest. I like if I get a liquid eyeliner, if it's like a good brand, it'll probably be about four quid. But that's just typical shops for you. Typical makeup for you. First world problems. Hashtag first world problems. So yeah. So yeah, this is the smudge eyeliner and this will be featured in my video. I got all of this like all the stuff for me anyway I think it, it came under tw £20 so I will be uploading a £20 makeup challenge and um, just just using the products that I got but as I said I didn't get a concealer and I don't know how well coverage that foundation is it said it's medium coverage but I'm not sure to be honest um, and that like includes uh, uh, like tools and brushes um, so I think I'm, I don't know how I'm going to manage with that mineral powder. I might cheat and just use something that I haven't got. If I, wait, what? No, I might cheat and use something that I didn't get today. Um, so sorry if I do. But yeah, this was the eyeliner. And now I'm going to be showing you... Why the heck is that there? Go away. So... Now I'm going to be showing you from lightest to darkest. I got lipsticks and lip glosses. I'm going to start with the lightest, so that would be this one. This is my favourite lipstick of all time. I absolutely love it. Uh, I've had one of these before, but it wasn't in this. It wasn't in this shade. Uh, I had a red one before, but it was like, uh, like a, like an opaque kind of red. But this is by PS. This moisturising, rich lipstick with vitamin E, and. Shea butter, I think my mum said, or I always used to say it's she, but because she has butter. Um, but this is in the shade Calypso, uh, and this is by PS, and it's like an orangey kind of corally kind of colour. Um, and I just love the container, I love the colour, I love like everything about it. So this will definitely be in a what do you, what are we in now? June, aren't we? Yeah, this will be in a June favourites video, which I will be uploading tomorrow. Next, I have this, which was one pound fifty uh, from PS from Primark, uh, and this is the High Shine lip gloss. And this one was in the shade. Okay. It was something, it sounds really weird, but it was, I think it was something like Naked Dream or something like that. It was Naked Something, which is really bad, but like weird. It's got a fat applicator, like not fat, it's like super thin, but you kind of have to pump it a lot to get a lot on. 
Um, and this is the colour of it. Hold on. So this is the colour. Um, and I just think it's really pretty and it's 150. Um, this is the applicator. It's very long applicator and I'm actually going to do a swatch. So yeah. So it's got a nice pastel colour to it, if you can see that. And I just fell in love with it <laughs> again. So it was good. Um, you know what, actually, I'm going to swatch this lipstick for you as well, which is the PS1. So here, once again, is what it looks like. Then next to the lip gloss. Seems like a very nude kind of tone. Uh, it's like a pinky nude. So, if I was to name this, which I can't because it's called, it's called Calypso, but if I was to name it, say if like I created this and I was allowed to name it, I would probably name it Nude Dream or something. I don't know. But that's what that looks like. Now, the last one I have is the High Shine Lip Gloss. This was in the shade Light Chocolate. No, Light Chocolate. Do they mind? What on earth was that? Like what? What on earth? <laughs> okay, so high shine lip gloss in the shade like chocolate. Um and this is basically what it looks like. And it's a bit of a dark colour, so I'm gonna swatch it for you. Sounds like a fart. <laughs> so, as you can tell by the applicator, it is a dark colour. I'm going to be swatching it for you now. So, here. So, pretty colour. Are you being serious? Can you shut up? Whatever it is. Sounds like it's coming from the wall, but yeah, that's what it looks like. It is pretty much brown, um, and I'm just I'm overjoyed with this colour. I actually really like it, um, and it's like a nudey kind of colour. But it's not nude, but it's it's on the way to being nude if you get what I mean. Which you probably don't, but oh well. Um, so yeah, that was my haul video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you guys next time with my. What am I doing next? Hmm, so I was going to do the $20, make, £20 makeup challenge and I was going to do the June favourites. I think I'll be doing my June favourites next, then I'll be doing the £20, £20 makeup challenge. So, yas. Yars, yars, yars. See you guys next time with another awesome video. Comment down below if you know what that horrible like fart sound was. And I'll see you guys next time with another awesome video. Goodbye.